Lee County Democrats are on board with Kamala Harris. I'm Lee County Community Correspondent Bella Line. I spent my day speaking with some of our local Democratic delegates who will be a part of that decision making process for who will be the next nominee. I even spoke to some Republicans and it's clear that no one really knows what's going to happen next. We are in unprecedented times. That's all there is to it. As history unfolds before our eyes, there's a sense for both Republicans and Democrats that anything can happen over the next three months. I spoke with two Florida Democratic delegates and both weren't entirely sure what to expect heading into the Democratic National Convention. Wow, we are super late in the game here and uh, we really have to rally together to make this bid work. It's Florida Democratic uh, Party, all of our delegates had a Zoom call last evening, seven o'clock on Sunday, and we were uh, talking about this and there seemed to be a a broad consensus uh, that uh, people supported Kamala Harris. So uh, I think she's going to earn that nomination. Monday, the Florida Democratic Party pledged its support for Vice President Kamala Harris, but some Democrats are calling for an open convention. Lee County Delegate Cindy Beignet says she's happy to back the Vice President in her run. We have major shifts going on with our parties and, you know, we need the American people need some leadership. We just got to hang on and and continue to fight for our democracy. I spoke with the Lee County GOP about the potential Democratic pick and Vice Chair Tara Jenner says she's not worried about Harris. As far as what the responsibilities are to secure our nation and establish our sovereignty by securing that border, she failed abysmal. It was a, a, a total disaster. And so um, I would say that Whatever he says was his uh, successes. No, <laughs> not even close. Reporting in Lee County, Bella Line, Fox 4.